जय हिंद डियर स्टूडेंट्स द प्रैक्टिकल दैट वी आर गोइंग टू डू टूडे इज वेरीफिकेशन ऑफ एलजेब्रिक आइडेंटिटी एक्स प्लस ए इंटू एक्स प्लस बी एंड दैट इज इक्वल टू एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस ए एक्स प्लस बी एक्स प्लस ए बी एंड आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस प्रैक्टिकल यू विल नेवर फॉरगेट दिस आइडेंटिटी फॉर दैट आई हैव टेकन फोर पीस ऑफ पेपर and i have colored it with four different colors you can also use four different colored papers here i have made a square of measurement 7 cm into 7 cm i have made a rectangle of measurement 5 cm into 7 cm i have taken another rectangle of measurement 3 cm into 7 cm and i have taken one more rectangle that is of measurement 3 cm into 5 cm with the help of this we are going to perform this practical so first let us talk about this square in this square if say i have taken this side as x so it is obvious that this side also will be x okay now if i talk about this rectangle so as you can see that the width is same in both the cases it means that if this is x this also will be x but you are finding that this measurement is not same as this so let us take any other variable say i have taken this as a okay now if i take the third one then you observe that the measurement of this the length of this is equal to x okay and the width is not this so for this i have taken this as x and this as b now you are observing that this b is equal to this that is why this will be b and this one is equal to the measurement of a see if this is the length of this is a so of this also it is it will be same because they both are having same measurement so in this way what you observe is that this is b and this is a so for performing this uh, practical the thing that you need to know is area of square and area of rectangle now when we talk about this blue square then you know that now the side are of same measurement that is why if this is x this also is x and area of square is side square so means of blue part it will be x square now this is rectangle you know that area of rectangle is length into breadth that is why if we talk about area of this figure then it will be a into x okay now when you talk about this figure then once again it will be length into breadth that is why the area of this will be b into x and if we talk about this figure then length into breadth so area of this figure will be a into b now uh, you have seen that area this is x square this is ax this is bx and this is ab now let us see how can we show this so once again i have taken the square whereas you know that the measurement of this is x then just beside it i have placed the rectangle in which you people saw that the measurement of this was a then you people also saw the yellow rectangle where you people saw that this is x from here till here and this was 
B and the last but not the least that is this rectangle where this was B and this is equal to A and this is now see entirely from here till here this is x plus a and this from here till here is x plus b okay from here till here it is x plus b it means that ultimately it is becoming a rectangle and if we have to find out area of this rectangle then it will be x plus a into x plus b and in beginning only people have found that this is x square this one is a b sorry a x this one is b x and this one is a b so when you are finding the area of this so that will be combination of this x square plus ax plus bx plus ab also for example if uh, you take the area of this figure in beginning only i told you people that this is 7 this is 5 so this total becomes 12 and if you take this measurement so this is 7 plus 3 means 10 so area of rectangle you know that it is equal to length into breadth so 12 into 10 means 120 centimeter square and if you do it in a separate way for example if you take say in beginning you have taken of this square so area of square equals to side square means 7 into 7 because the measurement of square is 7 centimeter means 49 centimeter square then if we take area of this rectangle area of rectangle you will find this as 5 into 7 means 35 centimeter square if you find out area of this rectangle area of rectangle equals to 3 into 7 and that will be equal to 21 centimeter square and then finally let us take area of this small square that is 5 into 3 so 5 into 3 will be equal to 15 centimeter square now let us add them all okay so area of this uh, figure will be area of figure will be equal to this is 7 into 7 which was 49 plus this is 5 into 7 means 35 plus this is 3 into 7 means 21 plus this is 15 centimeter square now if the sum of this you find out then you will find that this also is coming 120 meter square this clearly shows that in beginning when we took x plus a into x plus b then and if we are taking right now x square plus ax plus bx plus ab then also it is coming same this shows that x plus a into x plus b is equal to x square plus ax plus bx plus ab why because over here x plus a 
into x plus b when we are doing then we find that we are dividing this figure into four parts where the first part is x square the second part is ax the third part is bx and the fourth one is ab so i hope that with this you people are aware about this identity thank you for watching